So I've just had my Uni Fira delivered and so excited to get this up and running. It's a lovely sunny day, so perfect. And here you can see what I've received. I've got the um, Uni serving board, which is really good quality. And then below that, I've got the 12 inch piece appeal. And as well as that, I also ordered the fire starters, the, um, you know, obviously can't have, a, can't have a pizza oven without the fire starters and a infrared thermometer so I can um, make sure that the oven is to the right temperature. And then we've also got the wooden pellets to fuel the Uni Fira. It is a wood fired pizza oven, so it just uses those wood pellets. So let's have a look inside of the Uni Fira. I'll just lift this up and there we go. Get that open and have a look inside. So welcome to the Uni community. Packing is amazing and yeah, it's really good packaging. Looks really good. Here we have the pizza stone and inside we've got just a couple of booklets. We've got a, what we've got? We've got a, Uni Fira Essentials Guide. Um, so yeah, looks pretty good. Have a look in here, we've got um, some getting started tips, how to light the oven, um, some recipes, pizza dough, pizza sauce, um, how to maintain it. So yeah, pretty, pretty useful, good read. I'll have a look at that later. And then we have the extended three year warranty. So definitely worth making the most of that when you receive your uni fira getting that extra three-year warranty and then we've also got the manual and safety instructions which to be honest i don't think we'll need watched a few videos online on how to set this up so i'm pretty pretty confident that we'll be able to set it up without those instructions so here we have the uni pizza stone I don't think you'd be able to see it because of the, the glare from the sun, but it's got the Uni logo in the center and it looks pretty, pretty cool. And this basically goes into the actual Uni Fira. And then if we take this off, we have the Fira itself. And again, it's really well packaged. It's very well protected. Um, really happy with that. And it's actually quite lightweight. Um, I think it's only 10 kilograms, so lightweight, definitely easy to, to port, you know, for portability, carrying it around. Um, yeah, really looking forward to taking this onto the, hopefully onto the beach in the summer. Um, but yeah, definitely looking forward to, to firing this, this up. And as you can see, underneath we have the legs. And these simply just clip out like this and then it's incredibly sturdy. Because of the three legs, it just helps to make it a little bit more sturdy without that, that shake. Um, and they're easy to retract again when you wanna take it away. So I've just unpacked all of the stuff that's inside the Uni Fira um, so that I can start with assembling it. And here we have the back grill plate, and this is basically where you put the pellets and the fire starter. This is where the, the ultimately the, the flame's gonna to be to heat the, the pizza oven and that just slots into the back quite easily here and then we have the the actual door and it's got a nice little viewing, viewing platform so you can see um, straight into the pizza oven and it's great because it can easily just slot into place and then when you're launching your pizza or you're checking it taking it out you can just slot it on this bottom slot here and it just makes it really easy and then we just get the pizza oven and we just find this slot and slide that in and it will drop down into its own shelf. Next we have the chimney and it comes with a chimney cap and this is also used to pick up the pebbles and pour them down the hopper. So really useful. And the chimney itself is really easy to put together. You simply get the two pieces here and put them together and then position it onto the Uni Fira. Now you'll notice at the bottom, there's some grooves and there's a, an indent of a locked padlock and an unlocked padlock. You simply place it in line with the unlocked padlock, turn it to the, the right and then that will lock it into position. And then we take the hopper and we simply just place this into the back of the Uni Fira. And the hopper is basically where you're going to be pouring your pellets to, to load it up to 
continue that burn. And normally if you fill it up to the top, it, I think it will, I believe it will last for 15 minutes. So you just want to keep an eye on that hopper and keep topping it up if you're going to be using it for a while. So here we have it already built and ready to get our first pizza going. So one thing you do need to do before you actually start using your uni fire is you need to season it. You need to just give it that pre preheat so that you can wipe away any of the um, residue from the manufacturing process. So when we're using, we just put in our pellets into this back plate here, and then we'll put in a fire lighter towards the front and then we'll just light that up. And they light incredibly easily and quickly. And then we just slot that back into place and we're gonna oh let boy. that burn until all of those pellets have started to catch flames. And then we're gonna pour in some more into the hopper. So what you wanna do is just keep an eye on the temperature. You wanna check the temperature of the stone and you don't wanna be putting a pizza in there until it hits 400 degrees. That is the optimal temperature for the, the pizza to cook. And you wanna make sure that there's a rolling flame across the top of the pizza oven. So now the pizza oven is at temperature, it's ready for us to start cooking a pizza. And my four year old is ready for bed, but he has been watching me sort this pizza oven out. So he really wants to try a pizza. So I'm gonna make him a quick little cheese pizza. And so I've just put that in there now just to heat and it only takes 30 seconds before you want to give it a good good turn around and then every 30 seconds just give it a turn just keep checking on it it's going to cook incredibly quickly so here i'm just taking it out and we will give it a turn and then pull it back in and look at that it's colors lovely the cheese has gone over a little bit but the color is amazing um, now this is the first time that I've used the Unifira, so it is definitely a, um, there is a bit of a learning curve and just getting the timings right, um, but it's really easy to use and very, very convenient, you know, it's incredibly easy. I've got other pizza ovens that I've used, um, they're not, they just don't compare to be honest, this is so simple and so easy to use. So here we have it, the pizza I think is now done. We're gonna take that out and that looks lovely and I'm sure my son is gonna love it.